now we're at a point where we can see into the mechanisms in the body, we can see how everything's supposed to work. So I think the things that we need to develop now are one, more sensitive indicators of how well the detoxification is working, uh, make testing within the glutathione system readily available, not just what are your glutathione levels, but how well are the enzymes working. What are the other important uh, sulfhydryl compounds, uh, thioredoxin I'm very interested in. Can we test these? Can we correlate these with different problems? The genetics, the genetics are going to be great and uh, to be able to tell not just what genes you have but which ones are functioning and to be able to see uh, which are the most important genes for uh, which systems. I mean one of the classic mercury things is that Mercury can mimic so many different diseases, and mercury can hit you in so many different places based on what your weak link is. So can we have genetic panels that can say, well, your weak link is going to be over here, and thus we have to work on this system to fix that. Uh, I think that's where this is going. And, uh, and, and then understand what are the therapeutic uh, compounds. Uh, there's so many that are isolated right from plants that are so functional, that are so strong. Uh, just fleshing all of that in so that we have all the tools to tell, you know, what is your real key problem and how can we fix that in as, much, as, as natural a way as possible.